Hello students, hope you are doing good. Let's understand some more regular expression in this session also. As I was talking about uh, this regular expression solving or writing regular expression in the previous session also, we just continue with the same. This would be the last session on writing regular expression. Then we continue with uh, how do I convert regular expression to automata and vice versa. The first question for the session would be write a regular expression to accept strings of zeros and ones where tenth symbol from right end is one. Quite interesting, isn't it? Observe properly. Till now we were worried about the left hand side thing, or we were not worried about the positions. We were worried about the count as well as the pattern. But this also a problem where you can see this. So strings would be if you have ten symbols something like this observe you have 10 symbols here where in that case first symbol is one similarly if you have 11 symbol then second symbol should be one it doesn't mean other things should be uh, zeros i'm just telling similarly if you have uh, 12 symbols or 13 symbols it should look like this so if you observe from the right hand side, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10 symbol is 1. So we have to verify from right side, but not from left. Now, how do I solve this is the question. See, we are worried about 10th symbol. In that case, after 10th symbol, maybe 9th, 8th, 7th, till first symbol from right hand, we are not worried. It might be either 0 or 1. So can I write 0, 1 like this? Definitely I can write it. 0, 1, 0, 1, second symbol, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth. So if you see from right hand side, so nine symbols are ready. So tenth symbol must be 1. What about previous? Am I worried about it? No. Simple. Then you may ask, sir, how do you know I'll get it? 11 symbol only or 10th symbol, sorry. How do you get, you know, you have only 12 symbols or 13 symbols? That is what speciality of regular expression. If you have 12 symbols, first two symbols will be from 0 plus 1 whole star. 10th symbol is 1, remaining is like this. Interesting. Some also would write like this. I don't know whether it is valid or not. Some teachers or some people would write like this. So 0 plus 1 whole star 1, 0 plus 1 raised to the power 9. Uh, I am not pretty much sure about this. Usually I don't write it. I'm just giving an option for you. This is for simplicity purpose or maybe for right, reducing the lengthy thing. Nothing other than that. Okay. Interesting. Let's move on. So next would be next problem that would be second problem for the session here is a question that says write a regular expression to accept strings of a's and b's where fifth symbol from right is b and third symbol is a it's pretty much similar to the previous problem where we can just check out things would be something like this it says fifth symbol so b a a b b b check now third symbol is a and fifth symbol is b similarly b b a b b is accepted b b a a a it's accepted or a b b a a a something like this so now it is you know you can write it it's easy it would be a plus b whole star followed by b followed by a plus b followed by a followed by a plus b and a plus b check it out a plus b whole star is something which is required b is fifth symbol so fourth symbol might be anything again third symbol must be a second and first symbol would be either a or b hope it's clear 
let's go for next question here is the question write a relative expression to accept the language l equals a power n b power m such that n greater than equal to 2 and m less than equal to 3 this is not same as previous questions what we have discussed where we had another way of specifying the condition but here we have different way anyhow we can easily understand check out the question and write the set of valid strings you can just list it out it's it will be easy if you like write the list of valid strings check out there it says a power n so n is 2 that means the value of n should be always greater than or equal to 2 it can have 2 3 4 and so on but m should be always less than or equal to 3 how do i write it pretty much easy one thing you can observe it is always a followed by b here so you can write the condition of a first then you can write the condition of b so minimum string would be a a observe number of a's would be less, greater than 2 greater than or equal to 2 it is there number of b's would be either 0 b's 1 b 2 b or 3 b not more than that a a b a a a b a a a a b b something like this you can increase the number of a's but you cannot go beyond num uh, 3 for number of b's and always a is followed by b so you can write it as what is the minimum string would be a a a star can i observe properly yes because minimum string is a uh, minimum number of a's are two a's so it is a a followed by that should be epsilon or b or db or bbb this is very interesting because we have told number of b's should be less than or equal to 3 that means at most 3 the moment i say at most 3 that would include epsilon means maximum is 3 so you may have 0 1 2 or 3 so 0 is epsilon single b is b 2b and 3b pretty much easy so let's write uh, some pro one or two problems similar to this here is the question you can just check out write a regular expression to accept language l equals a power x b power y c power z where x y z is greater than zero it's pretty easily you can understand not in at all an issue if you have solved the pre uh, problem number three i think uh, solving this problem may not be much difficult for you how just check if you can able to observe the question it says everything is greater than zero so i can say it is a b c is minimum string a a b b c c is the next string and you can have variations of this because powers of a b c are different since it is greater than zero you can have your minimum string would be a b c even this would be accepted because you may have various values for a b c's interesting so now strings would be a a star b b star c c star or this can also be written as a plus okay it is positive closer a plus b plus c plus where this plus should be an as a subscript if you can check the previous videos i have explained about positive closure also where positive closure is always having minimum length as one symbol star closure will have minimum of zero symbols or more so positive closure is one or more star closure is zero or more this also can be written for our understanding purposes both are valid moving on next problem would be almost similar to this i say greater than or equal to zero let's read the question question says write a regular expression to accept language l equals a power x b power y c power z where x y z is greater than or equal to zero 
very simple you can uh, check out that the string should be epsilon is accepted agreed because uh, it is if all the values becomes zero it would accept epsilon then it might be a it might be b it might be c a b c a a b b c c and so on fine then expression would be very easy a star b star c star pretty much easy but what if suppose instead of writing a power x b power y c power z if you give a power n b power n c power n then these strings may vary this would remain same still this would remain same still but this would vary since you say n you should have equal number of uh, a's b's and c's we'll have last problem to this session the question is write a regular expression to accept the language l equals a power x p power y where x greater than 0 y greater than 0 but x y should be greater than or equal to 3 that means x and y separately minimum strings are 0 and more but if you combine both there should be minimum 3 that means you can have 0 a's but b should be 3 if you have 0 b's a should be 3 so you can list some of the strings for that shall i skip the strings no let's write it i can write a b b b b or uh, a a a b b b a b b a a b b something like this you can check out these strings but now how do i write it so now we should specify it specifically for uh, x separately y separately x y together so i can write it like this i just write it then i'll explain it a can be zero or more but b should be three in that case definitely so b b b b star hope that's clear any number of a's but you should have three b's minimum or or i'm putting plus a a a a star b star check out three a's followed by a number of b's that works again you may have uh, other combination you may have two uh, a one b or uh, something like that that can be written like this a a star b b b star or a a a star b b star check any other combinations when you get it check it out now you have a single a to b two a single b that's fine so these are the options you can get it so this would be the solution for that similarly you can write some more problems i just leave it to you i won't solve the problem i just leave it to you people just check it out a power x b power y c power z where x less than equal to 4 y greater than or equal to 3 z less than equal to again 4 and i write the solution i don't write the explain it you just try to understand i can write epsilon is accepted i draw the epsilon later or uh, string epsilon would be accepted because of the condition check out can i write like this up so properly the conditions for a b c are different so we are writing it separately so for a it is x less than equal to 4 so maximum you can have four years so it is a plus a a plus a a a plus a a a a four years over followed by what is y number of b's is three minimum so it is b b b b 
star again next one it is for c for c it is same as a so it is c or cc or cccc or cccc clear that's all for the session thank you for watching subscribe the channel click the bell button share with your friends and the needy people thank you very much